Hi guys, today I'm demoing one of the most powerful Android Wear apps I've ever demoed before. It's called Auto Wear and what it allows you to do is use your Android Wear device in conjunction with Tasker to create some really amazing things. So let me go ahead and show you. Phone settings. So right now what you're about to see is a notification that's going to pop up on my phone that I created using entirely this application and Tasker. So the first screen you saw there, all of the text, all of these buttons I created using AutoWare without any programming. No programming, no coding needed. Uh, right now you can see that my Wi-Fi is off, my screen is dimmed. And then if I go back over to my watch and the notification that just popped up and I click Home, Using Tasker, it's going to increase my screen brightness, it's going to turn on my Wi-Fi, it's going to raise the ringer volume, all these things using AutoWare and using Tasker. So the notification, the buttons, all of the actions that happen on your phone and happen on your Android Wear device are all happening through AutoWare and Tasker. It's so cool. You can really unlock the power of your Android Wear device now. You can do virtually anything you want to do. You can create apps, you can send notifications, you can have anything happen. Self-destruct. So here's another little funny application thing that I like to do with Tasker now and again. And this is a Star Trek thing. Uh, you can see that I created a little pop-up that has a... Um, accept or deny button uh, with the Star Trek logo and this is a self-destruct thing. So let's go ahead and hit accept. Warning, self-destruct sequence has been initiated. Warp core overload in four minutes, 55 seconds. There will be no further audio warnings. And now we have a timer going both on the watch and on the phone showing us how much time until our self-destruct is, is going to happen. And of course this is just a silly little thing and not practical, but it's a lot of fun and it shows you the power of you can launch apps on your phone, you can launch apps on your Android Wear device, you can have music or audio files playing just like you saw me do right there. So very, very powerful, very versatile. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of the example screens that AutoWare can create. Right now I'm going to launch up a single screen with text on it, and then if you tap on it, it will launch a task. You also have the option to create a screen in four different sections with five different clickable areas. This would be really useful for like a media application with rewind or fast forward, volume up, volume down, and you can create that using Tasker. Uh, here is a list screen, so if you had a bunch of different tasks and you want them all to show up in a list, you could do that or if you want a dialogue screen like I used on the self-destruct with a cancel or accept. And then here's a confirm screen. This just gives you time to confirm that you want to run a task before it actually executes. And then here is just a text screen. So for long text, you can do scrolling text with a title at the top. And then finally, you have a keyboard screen with different number inputs. So if you wanted to use some sort of like calculator thing, uh, that'd probably be tough to do in Tasker, but I guarantee you it's possible. You could definitely do it. Uh, so yeah, those are just some example screens. AutoWare also has a bunch of different events that can trigger your tasks. So when your Android Wear battery is low, when you shake your Android Wear device, when you turn on or off the screen, things like that. So it's very, very useful. Let's go ahead and take a look at one of the tasks that I've already set up. We'll take a look at the phone settings task that I created. And what triggers my task is Auto Voice. And Auto Voice is made by the same developer as Auto Wear. So you'll want to download both of those. Auto Voice is what allows you to create essentially your own Google Now like commands. And using that, I set it to whenever I say phone settings to then launch the Auto Wear task. And then within AutoWare, I'm able to create all those screens that you saw, and I can change the title of the screen, what it says on the screen, I can change how the buttons look, uh, what the icons of the buttons are, what the background, the foreground, very, very versatile and very easy to change. And then, of course, you can change what tasks each button actually activates. 
I'll be honest with you, there is a huge learning curve with this. If you've never used Tasker before and you've never used Auto Voice before, if you just try to download AutoWare and learn all of this at once, it's going to be very overwhelming for you. It's going to be like jumping into the deep end of the pool. So my advice is download Tasker, get familiar with Tasker, do that one day, then download Auto Voice, get familiar with Auto Voice, and then after you're familiar with both Tasker and Auto Voice, then download AutoWare. That will make your transition a bit easier. I'm also going to link to some material in the description down below of sources that will help you learn AutoWare. I think this is a great little application. It can really make your Android Wear device way more powerful. I absolutely love it. Highly recommend downloading it. And I cannot recommend this highly enough. I'd love to hear what you guys have done with it. So leave your comments down below and let me know what cool creations you guys have come up with. Thanks for watching, guys. If you're interested in learning more about any of the apps you saw in this video, you can find their Google Play download links in the description below. I always love hearing your feedback, so leave me a comment and let me know what you thought. And finally, if you enjoyed this video and you'd like to stay up to date with the latest apps and Android Wear developments, click the subscribe button. I'll see you guys next time.